in my mind that I was supposed to meet. Does that and, mean that? Um, well, we'll we'll learn about this. <laughs> 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 so I when I say essence, right? Like I didn't I didn't know what its face looked like or anything like that. It was just like this essence kind of feeling, and I would fall in love with other people. And I had several different relationships before this one. You um, did? I did. <laughs> um, and even though I loved those people, um, there was always this feeling like, man. I'm supposed to be with someone else. And it always kind of made me in this place of like being half in and half out of any relationship. And that is not a good space to be in, by the way. <laughs> it will absolutely create there. unhealthiness. Um, but as soon as I really finally learned the lessons, did the work that we've been talking about, that we're teaching in this program, out of nowhere, when I wasn't even really expecting it, honestly, when I was like, I am done with guys, like I'm mm -hmm. done, I don't want to do anymore. Like I need to just focus on me and keep learning and growing. He like appeared and as soon as I met him, I was like, that's the guy. This is yeah. the guy the whole time that I've been waiting for and hoping for and praying for and wishing for and visualizing for. Um, and but and it was like a, in an instance, I was like, that's my person. Like, this is it. And yeah. and I, I say that, but I also want to note that that is not everyone's story. Like loves comes in very different forms, shapes, sizes, experiences. Mm -hmm. But there is a theme of when you do the work it shows up yeah and I think another thing too that you said let go um, I think let go is such a resounding theme out there when you're doing the work and I think it's so key because I think when you let go uh, of the things that are not serving you anymore when you let go to the things a lot of people are insane we were insane at one point you may be insane <laughs> what I mean by that is if you look at the definition of insanity you may have may or may not have heard this but it's doing the same things over and over and over again and experience and expecting a different result Right? A lot of times we'll attach ourselves to things and then it doesn't end up working out and then you experience suffering. We will have expectations of this is exactly the guy that I need to have and they need to exactly have that. And that's that's good and we'll talk about that. But sometimes it'll show up in a different way and if you don't give that a chance in a way, mm -hmm. um, it just, there's some things of, of, of how to be open to things. and. And I think the letting go is just such a resounding theme. So it's like letting go and letting God, source, universe, whatever you want to call it, um, allowing that process to unfold. Mm -hmm. And I think when I talk, when I think about my stuff, a lot of people just are like doing, 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 doing. But you also have to just be mm -hmm. as well, like just be, you know? And then the third component, and we'll break this down later in other videos, is the allowing. Yeah. Right. And so like right now, for instance, there's trees and beautiful trees all around us. If we're going to be watering a tree, there's just, you know, so much water that we can pour in that tree. There's so much sunshine that we can give. There's so much like soil. You can't like overwater. You got to allow it to grow. <laughs> so allow yourself to grow. And I think when we think about, um, I know you shared a few things that helped you kind of find me. When I think about the things that allowed me to find you was really practicing presence really finding my purpose, really getting my power back from all the times that I've lost my power, mm -hmm. was really uh, being prepared, like practicing all the things that we're gonna be teaching you in other videos to really be prepared for what's to come. And also, and last but certainly not least, building my tribe, you know, all the people that support me, that are there for me, having that support system is so huge along the journey. And I think the moment all those were in place, I started to feel more comfortable my, with myself. Mm -hmm. I started to feel just, I finally loved myself at the end of the day. Yeah. Right, which I think is a yeah. big thing that we talk I about. I think that, that's, the, that's the biggest thing. And that's thing. when you showed yes. up. Yep, is when you finally learn how to really love yourself, you attract at that kind of level someone else who's really loving themselves and then you're able to have this beautiful, supportive, healthy relationship because both people really know how to love themselves and each other in a really healthy, supportive way.